Now, so far, I gotta say the season has been going well for us because you see we are officially 3-0 in this thing, going through Colorado, Auburn, and Alabama, taking out the whole state of Bama, man. It's all good with that. And now we got LSU and Florida on the schedule, so another set of SEC opponents that we gotta take down. But I know a lot of y'all like to see the fit before every game, and this is what we're gonna be going with with this one, man. Got the towel on the right hip, got the calf sleeves looking clean, and got the 11s on our feet. Hey, we gonna be right going in to this set of games yo but now it's time we go ahead and start our weekly training but before that a hey, it's dynasty deep dive week for college football 25 so make sure you're locked in on the channel make sure to subscribe turn on those notifications because we will be talking about that information this week and hey man i'm excited for it but hey let's get into it Let's see if we can kick this thing off, get something going. Got that return though. Oh yeah. Hey, look, I had a lane in the middle though. I was looking for it. They got three receivers out here. Not concerned. There we go. Playing it short. And I think we played that well. We really can't press this team like that. Three receivers, one tight end. That tight end could really cause a problem for us. Make sure we're locked. Still scrambling, and he had to throw it away. Fourth and 11. Come on. What a possession. And our offense did what they had to do, thankfully. See, though. Oh, they're playing quick game now, I see. See, we got some coverage. Oh, my goodness. And he dropped that bad boy. I thought I had a chance if he threw that to the right of him. At this point, I'm just happy our offense is moving. This looks like a run play, though. I ain't gonna lie to you. Something quick. Underneath. I like this setup. I think this is gonna be a stretch to the left side. Okay. We out here, but I'm getting pancaked. And thankfully, my guy stepped up for me. Third and inches. I'm not even anticipating a stop here. Wow. Hey, the fact that they almost didn't get that locked in got me on the running back. Let's see. He's running it. And goodness gracious. <laughs> Ain't think he was going to shuck me off like that, though. Look, like I said, only got like 80 tackling. So I was trying to keep this build in check without being overpowered. Oh, this is a corner route. And neighbors on this side, too? Yeah. Oof. We got a third and two situation. They're going quick. Had to bring a little bit more heat this time. And hopefully this man is out the game. Look, we actually got that hit stick to connect on that. Playing to the inside a little bit. They're running the ball yet again. And I'm going with that pressure now. We want to let them know that it's not going to be easy. And a big sack in the back. These boys are getting there. I'm glad our offense is playing well. We're doing the things necessary. Oh, we. And oh my goodness. The fact that I'm missing tackles like this is insane. 87. I'm trying to hit stick. Let me not, bro. Let me just go for simple tackles at this point. Straight like that. And simple tackles not even working. What? They just wanted to go hurry up till they got in field goal range. I don't blame them one bit. Boy, nice breakup. 13 locked in. We're going with this nickel formation quite a bit. Trying to get him. I needed him to get that tackle, and long as one of us brought him down, that was good. Third and one situation. I can see this being a corner route. Look, we're out here playing it well, and Jaden Daniels almost broke away. Glad somebody got to that. Fourth and two, they're going for it, so we got to just play up on the line a little bit here. I'm expecting a quick slant. Of course, these quick underneath routes eating us up, bro. Can't lie to you. We got to get out there on them. And what is that? Can neither one of us tackle them? So LSU still got three, but that's better than six. We just got to hold them off because they're such a good team. 
Little juke. Ain't hey, nothing crazy, though. I do need to free roam a little bit better. Play underneath this. He's already cutting across. Beautiful. One of us got to that. Loss of yardage. We're pretty much manned up on everything. Oh, he's going underneath. What a tough contested catch by neighbors, man. We decided to switch it up a bit and have me guard neighbors. I know it's a pass play coming too. We're underneath that though. Yes, sir. Playing that so well. We're sitting pretty right now. Let's continue. Running the ball. And boy, oh boy. We switched the strategy just a bit and it's paying off. Not necessarily an explosive game for me, you know? Make sure nothing happening underneath. He got that man neighbors, but boy, we had numbers around him, and that's a big stop. I think it's really good our offense is staying the course. One of my gloves is glitched out right now for some reason. See? Playing that well. And goodness gracious, man. It's either 87 or it's neighbors, dog. You got two great receivers. It is what it is at this point. And he running. And I tried to go up and help just a bit there. Two receivers tight end. I see this is probably going to be some type of drag concept. Never mind. It's just a simple run play. And he's breaking off of almost everything. Boys got me concerned out here. You know? Making it difficult. Oh, what play art. I'm going with the deep ball. And neighbors hit me with the quickest stop route. Another RPO, man. And he got nothing but space. That's crazy. He pulled the rock 13-2. and two. I don't know what their plan was. And I had to come all the way across the field. I got to say straight up, that really wasn't like a phenomenal game by the defense. We really just survived out here. Getting stops where we needed to, it was solid team defense, but it wasn't necessarily anything electric. Like, I couldn't go crazy on the picks at all. If we go to the player stats and just go to the defensive side of the ball, man, if we just take a look at Tennessee, like, nothing really happened other than just tackles, right? Nobody got a pick. I got two tackles on the day, so it was a true team defense performance out here. So now with this next game, we got Florida on the schedule, and it's that time, man. Let's see if we can go ahead and continue this win streak and hopefully have some more electric plays happening for us. See if we can start this game off right, man. Little press. And they're running the ball. And we just need our front four to get a little bit more aggressive. They got three wide outs. Oh, I'm guarding Ricky Pearsall, too? And oh, my. They're secure catching out here. We're in trouble. Three tight ends. One running back. What's the play here? Running to the outside. And we're shedding all that. Assisting. Here we go. Second and 12. Oh, and look, another secure catch. Look, I just got to trust my film study low key. Oh, we jumping that. Look, we ain't get no picks versus LSU. But if they throw in those, boy, we got to make sure we hop on it. Pause. Look, quarterback took his time. He threw a duck. And we had to just run underneath that. And we went down and capitalized on that, which is good. Guarding that man Pearsall now, though. Oh, man, running a little bit. He tried to cut that back inside. Hey, hopefully that's a holding penalty. Yes, sir. They got two wide outs. I'm expecting slants. Or a quick dive play. Man. What simple offense they're running, dog. I mean, it ain't working out at all. Second and 20. I'm going to go ahead and call for a pass here. They're running it. No, oh, sir. We're on that. Solo tackle city right now. On this man, Pearsall. He's going out, and it don't matter because the big dog's getting back there. Fourth and 24. 
Now we got a chance here. Let's see if we get a decent return. Don't journal that. Mm. And it took me too long to get out of that animation. Went down and scored again, which is nice. I'm going to go ahead and press up on Pearsall. Oh my gosh. I knew I was going to the inside, but dang, I didn't think I was going to get that bad of an animation. Third and fourth scenario. We're calling for the pass right now. Screenplay. And it's not working. Offense is moving down the field and getting what it can get. So I respect it. Make sure we protect anything to the outside. And my goodness, I got absolutely destroyed. Pause. I need to make sure I steer clear of anything on the inside. We chopped that down, though. I tried it. Let's make sure we get on the outside. Pearsall, though, not coming down with it. Unfortunate. But we've had a lot of opportunities on the punts. I think I need to just stop journaling. Low key. But I ain't getting nowhere with these simple jukes, though. <laughs> Offense is continuing to work. See if I can press this a little bit. Beautiful. And we had guys underneath on that. Now they're starting to call a few timeouts here. I'm anticipating the pass, though. Not going to lie. Ooh, look, I thought I could close the gap. I was thinking slants the whole way. Okay, he jumped that bad boy. Come on, let's run. I tried to go up there and get a block for him, but what a pick. That man just broke on the ball something simple. No complication at all. Another score, too. It's not a bad game for us at all. Running the ball yet again. We're playing good man-to-man -man coverage. Trying to stay active here. He's going across quick. There we go, third and one. Only two receivers, I'm gonna play this a little tight though, just in case they run something quick. Oh no, that's not what you wanna do. I mean, we're giving them another chance, but we don't want them to have it easy, you know? Beautiful, mean sack. They are absolutely struggling on the offensive side. We got a chance here. Okay. Look, we just don't need him to have that speed. I'm going to cut back through. And what a return. Look, that's the best one we done had today. What I need to do in those situations is just set the edge. Jam it a bit. He ain't have nowhere to go. And I thought I almost got a legal contact there, to be fair. Worth an 18. And we got another punt return opportunity here. See? Okay, maybe stop and hesitate. That's a decent return. They got three wide out, four pretty much with that tight end up there. I'm going to jam this though. Oh, man. Man, I thought it was going to be sweet. Oh, I thought I could bring the boom on that though. Oh, I can see this being a slant. Something quick, and I'm jumping that bad boy. You see me with the little film study out here, and we just going to dive in with a quick pick six to put this game on ice that man jam him out here we were looking for that slant play all day and i knew they were going to go back to it at some point in time and we made them pay i think we had a phenomenal makeup game after that LSU, it was team defense. We needed everybody to contribute because Jaden Daniel was slicing us up. And against Florida, we really got to show up and show out. If we go to the defensive side of things and just take a look at Tennessee, man, hey, we have five tackles, two picks, and a pick six. We put up the numbers that were necessary out here. I gotta say that wasn't bad to have a look at team defense and also that show off ability that that man Jamum has. I wanted to try to get a pick on Jaden Daniels, but it just didn't work out. But outside of that, man, make sure to subscribe to the channel, turn on those notifications and like the video because I would truly appreciate it. And make sure to catch the other episodes if you haven't seen them yet. I'll see you guys in the next one.